Well, I mean, if we've been going at, at hammer and tongs, Tony will need a very long sleep. Uh, dicky dicker. And I mean, sexually, Bev is an athlete compared to Marie. Obviously, she's quite an advantage since Marie's accident. Yeah, she never wanted it after the accident, did she? Uh, I mean, if I entered her vaginally, she claimed she couldn't feel it. That was before the accident. Yeah. I mean, Tony will try all sorts, but um, he had an allergy, so... Not nice. Swelled up like a baboon. A balloon. Lovely to look at, but a lot of pain. Well, my ex-wife Marie's accident really put a kettle on the stove. That kettle came to the boil with Bev. She took the lid off the kettle and she poured it. Amen. Plus, Marie had a very early menopause. Very, very difficult time for me. She had problems, she had problems down below. I'm not going to go into details. Too much respect for the woman. What I will say is, you can't have a roast dinner without the gravy. That's it. Too dry. I mean, you're very adventurous, aren't you? You try anything. Yeah. But uh, sometimes some of his suggestions, in all honesty, you know, he will come knocking around my back door and uh, I have had to kick up a bit of a rinkus because at the end of the day, I don't know how normal that is. Normal is as normal does. And as I always say, you know, try it once. And if you don't like it, we'll come back to it in a few nights. What's he reading? What paper is it? Oh, it's the Daily Mail. Yeah. Actually, Look at him, there are, new, there are new shoes, those are. Dick shoes. Put dick shoes on a depressive, you're asking for trouble. And put him on a boat, he'd throw himself over the side, take his own life. I'm surprised by the mail, that's a good paper. Off work with depression, but not too depressed to get Sky Digital. Okay. 76 channels of hell, 24 hours a day. Every one of them run by Satan. I try to be very... I try to be understanding. Yeah. Turn it down! I can't believe they're going on holiday. 